My question is to the Treasurer. Will the Treasurer explain to the House how the Morrison government's effective economic leadership is helping to create a stronger and more secure economy as we embark on our comeback from the COVID-19 recession? The Treasurer. Thank you very much, Mr Speaker. And I thank the member for Herbert for serving in the Australian Defence Force, yeah, Mr yeah, Speaker, yeah. and being a champion on mental health issues, yeah, on veterans issues, on infrastructure, Mr Speaker, and more than 70 thousand taxpayers in the member for Herbert's electorate are getting a tax cut as a result of policies supported by this side of the House, Mr yeah. Speaker. And around 4,000 businesses in Herbert have been benefiting from the JobKeeper program. Now, the member for Herbert, like other members on this side of the House, understand that the Australian economy has faced its biggest hit since the Great Depression. It saw a reduction in quarterly growth in June of 7%. This compared to a fall of around 12 per cent in New Zealand, 14 per cent in France and around 20 per cent in the United Kingdom. But, Mr Speaker, the economic comeback is on, Mr Speaker. The economic comeback is on, Mr Speaker. Well, I take the interjection from the member for Chifley. We welcome his comeback too, Mr Speaker. Yeah, it <laughs> but it is not as impressive as the Australian economy's comeback, Mr Speaker, because what we have seen is Members consumer sentiment... Sides. Consumer sentiment is up by 4.1 per cent this month. Up by 4.1 per cent this month, where we've seen four consecutive months of consumer sentiment rising. And Bill Evans, the Westpac's chief economist, saying that consumer sentiment has fully recovered from the COVID-19 recession. And yesterday we saw business confidence up, Mr. Speaker, and we've seen strong jobs growth. We have seen 80 per cent of the 1.3 million Australians who either lost their jobs or their working hours reduced to zero at the start of the pandemic, we have seen them back at work, Mr Speaker. And 178,000 jobs were created last month. And the effective unemployment rate has reduced from 14.9 per cent down to 7.4 per cent. And in the month of October, we have seen 2 million fewer Australian workers on JobKeeper compared to the month of September. And that may be cafes in Sturt, Mr Speaker, crane drivers in Lindsay, Mr Speaker, cake makers in Reed. We have seen right across the country businesses graduating from JobKeeper and workers no longer needing that income support. And we also saw in the September quarter 3.3 per cent GDP growth here in Australia, which meant year on year the Australian economy is performing better than France, than Germany, the United Kingdom, than Canada, than Japan and than New Zealand, Mr Speaker. So the economic comeback is on. Australians are getting back to work. It's still a tough road ahead, but the efforts and the policies of the Morrison government are making a difference for the better.